check this out guys, we are back with a brand new episode on the channel, welcome my friends, I hope you're all having a great weekend, but I have got a huge announcement today. So yesterday, I asked all of you, my subscribers, whether you wanted me to buy a Spring Special or loads of Builder Boosts. Now loads of you said the Spring Special, but loads of you also said the Builder Boost, and uh, I've kind of come to my own conclusion, we're going to be buying some gems inside of this episode guys, but you can all see the title of the video, can we get to Town Hall 11 accounts guys. So welcome to my Town Hall 9 account. This is of course Captain Tony. Let me just buy the resource potion as well. And uh, I kind of figured guys, Town Hall 12 is gonna be coming out this summer. I predict it will be coming out, I'm gonna say between June and early August guys. That is my personal prediction. I could be wrong, but uh, we'll see what happens. And I figured, why don't I try and get two Town Hall 11 accounts and combine them both inside of the same clan, guys? Because I plan to play this game for at least another year or two, guys, until I get extremely bored of it. But I'm having a lot of fun right now on my main account, General Tony. And if you've been subscribed to the channel for a while, you will know we've been maxed out for quite some time. Or almost maxed out. And I'm going to have to put a lot of my time into the Captain Tony base, guys. So, we're going to start off by buying ourselves... I'm going to go for the Builder Boost, guys, because I don't really want War Rings. So, let's get ourselves at least a few of these. Okay, so here we go. Do we have some, uh, some money inside of our wallet? I hope so, guys. It should give me my purchase. And there it is. Confirm your in-app purchase. Do you want to buy the special offer for $9.99? Yes, we do, guys. And that's going to give me 5 million gold. So, let's just grab another one. And we're going to click the buy right there as well, guys. And that's going to give me an extra book of building, another 5 million gold, and some more of those uh, those actual potions. So, first off, let me grab a screenshot. We've got 11 million gold inside of my account. Now, this is my proposition to you guys. If this video can get 4,000 likes, I'm going to try and get this account to Town Hall 11 before Town Hall 12 is released, guys. Now, if you want to join me on the journey... Feel free to subscribe to the channel, guys. We post videos every single day. I post COC videos every day. One of the only remaining COC YouTubers, guys. So sub to the channel, join the family, and help us reach 2.5 million subs. So this is my Captain Tony account. I've been playing it for about a year now, and we are a Town Hall 11. Sorry, a Town Hall 9, guys. So I've currently got, check these statistics, one builder free. And we are currently upgrading a gold mine, a wizard tower, and then two extra gold mines, guys. But those builders are going to be free quite soon. But as I said, should we go for two Town Hall 11s? Let me know, guys. But I also want to know how many accounts do you have and what Town Hall levels are they? Let me know down below. So, we got 11 million gold. Let's see what upgrades we can do. Straight to the queen. She's going to cost 39,000 Dark Elixir. The king... He's going to cost 27 and a half. So uh, we're going to try and upgrade the king here in this episode. Let me also grab myself a challenge, guys. What is this? Knock out 125 levels worth of heroes in multiplayer battles. That's only, uh, that's going to take me quite some time. So we're going to do that challenge anyway. But let me spend this gold, guys. 11 million in gold. Pretty damn nuts. And uh, we didn't get any gems. That didn't give me gems. It just gave me some, uh, some potions. So... Into the magic items, we've got ourselves two Book of Buildings, which we're going to use one soon. I've got a Book of Heroes. Only get 50 gems for that. That's not really worth it, guys. And uh, we've got a Resource Potion. We've got a Training Potion. And we have four Builder Potions. Brewed by the Builder in case of emergency all night. As this invigorating potion allows your Builders to work ten times faster. But we're not going to be using that, guys, because I don't really want to play the Builder Space. So, what we are going to do... We are going to use our book of building on one builder, and we're going to do that on the gold mine, which is two days and nine hours. So here we go, guys. Let's click the finish now button, and we're going to boost all of our resources as well. So I did buy that. Yes, we did. So we can also get a book of heroes, but there's no space in the clan castle, guys. So let me do some upgrades. Two builders. What can we upgrade? What is the most expensive defensive upgrade? We've got 3.7 million for that uh, that wizard tower. We have got the other wizard towers, guys. Cannon's going to cost 3 million. That's quite expensive. Expos, 4 million. Let's do expos, guys. 8 days. Let's do a second expo. That's going to be 10 days. 
And I believe with Channel 9, you only get two Expos. So that takes us already to 2 million in resources, guys. So we just spent about 9 million. So let's get ourselves into a couple of live attacks. Is there anything in the treasury? No, there is not. And uh, let's get ourselves some more loot. And this time, we are going to get ourselves into the Crystal League, guys. I've been inside of the Gold League for so long. Let's see if we can get into the Crystal League. I do plan, fingers crossed, to get 7,000 Dark Elixir in this episode and get the king to level 8 guys so let's see if we can find ourselves a nice amount of dark elixir this base actually is pretty damn decent guys pretty damn decent indeed i think i can grab that dark elixir and there's also some some drills around the edges as well so what i'm gonna do i am going to try and kill this king guys so before we kill the king let me just drop in a couple of archers and pick off some of these buildings, guys. It's some 3%, so we may as well take it. Let's do this. Here we go. And uh, I think that is all we're going to do. Let's see if we can get a minion. Nope, we can't. Okay. I wanted to kill the bomb tower, but it obviously didn't want to work. So, earthquake spells. We are going to open up these walls over here. We should be able to open up all of them and not even need wall breakers. Awesome. So, we got a straight shot into that dark elixir drill, guys. Now, I'm going to use my queen. This is going to be a little bit dodgy. But we're going to use three giants, two wizards, and my queen to kill this defending king, guys. So can we get his hit points down low enough as the giants are distracting? Check it out. The wizards do the job. And we've done it. Awesome. So the queen's going to kill that defending hog rider. Only drew one out, but there are more inside of there, I'm guessing, guys. And we're going to let this queen do some damage. Now, while she is going to work, I am going to use the rest of the army over here, guys. So there's the queen. There go all our wizards and, of course, our giants. There go the heroes and the uh, the other P.E.K.K.A. There goes a rage spell. There go the archers just behind, guys, trying to make a nice little funnel. And uh, let's just drop some of these minions in the edge. So there goes the king's ability. Can we get ourselves this dark elixir? That is the question. There goes the queen's ability. Currently only on 35%, guys. Maybe I bit off a little bit more than I can chew. Here we go, the P.E.K.K.A. Oh, I thought it was going to go for the Dark Elixir. Check it out. Takes out the gold storage. But completely misses that Dark Elixir, guys. So now it comes down to the Queen and the Minions to get me a 1-star. At least we're going to get a 1-star. We did get a little bit of Dark Elixir, but a lot less than I actually wanted, guys. I think we got about a 1,000. And uh, we're not even going to get a loot bonus for this because we're currently not inside of a league. But we got a 1-star. Let's end it there. Let's change the army up, guys. So 52%. In order for me to farm faster, challenge progress 35 as well. So in order for me to farm faster and uh, upgrade this base, I'm going to need to start to compete in clan wars more. I'm also going to need to build a new army. So let's remove this army down the bottom. Let's come up with something a little bit better, guys. Now, I'm only going to use a single jump. We've only got nine spells. So what about a jump, a double rage... Let's go for a heal spell and a poison. Now, that's 108,000 elixir. That's actually not too bad. We're going to go for four healers now instead of three. We're going to bring a couple of wall breakers, guys. Let's go for four. We are going to load up on giants because, to be honest with you, once they become level six, they're actually quite strong. We're going to bring eight wizards instead of 12. And uh, I'm still going to use a P.E.K.K.A. That takes us to 240,000 elixir. So... Gonna need to bring in some Dark Elixir now. Let's go for three of those. No, hold on. Let's reduce the Giant. And let's go for four Valkyries. And let's bring a Minion, guys. So that is my new army. Is it gonna be powerful? I'm not sure. 240,000 Elixir, 400 Dark Elixir. It's quite a nice balance. So uh, hopefully we'll be able to get a job done. So, can we research anything? No, we can't. We've only got a half a million elixirs, so we definitely need to start saving some money, guys. But I want to try and complete this. So once this is done, the rewards we're going to get are pretty damn awesome, guys. And there's two days and 19 hours left inside of this clan game. Pretty damn sweet. So let's get ourselves into a second live attack, guys. If we get a one star, we're going to unlock ourselves a, uh, an actual star bonus and hopefully find some dark elixirs. So let's see what we can find. Currently inside of the Gold 2 League, about 250 trophies away from... Oh, here we go. 250 trophies away from the Crystal League, guys. Okay. A lot of money in this base. We're going to make profit on Elixir as well, which is awesome because usually we don't make that much Elixir. But if I want to do some more upgrades inside of the laboratory, 
We're gonna start to need farm up some more elixir, guys. Okay. Can I get any of these collectors? I might be able to snap this one using a minion. No. Okay, that's cool, guys. That's cool anyway. Okay, so what side do we want to attack from? Well, I want to go for the Dark Elixir again. So we're going to drop in these Wall Breakers. Sorry, Earthquake spells over there. We are going to use our Queen. We're going to use her on the opposite side. I feel like we can take all these buildings here, guys, without really needing a Rage spell. I'm going to use the Queen's ability. I want to save my Rage spells for the army. So... Whilst that is going in, in the uh, the other side, we're going to send in the Giants with the Wizards, King, there goes the Pekka, and there go our Wall Breakers, guys. Now remember, this is my attempt to try at least and get two Town Hall 11 bases. It might not be, you know, it might not work. Maybe we won't have enough time to farm up the rest of my Town Hall 11 walls and upgrade this base at the same time, but I'm definitely going to start playing it more. I do need to get it at least to Town Hall 10, guys, so there goes the Queen's Ability. She's actually done pretty damn good and uh, taking on a lot of those buildings. Whilst that queen is distracting those, we're going to use these troops to try and take out that Dark Elixir Drill. We got the King's Ability in the center. Unfortunately, we didn't manage to grab all that gold over on the other side. But the queen gets a couple of shots off before she's... Uh... Hold on. I thought she was going to go down, but she somehow survives. And uh, looks good. Okay, can we take out this Tesla Tower and get this Queen to do a little bit more damage? Yes, we can. It's awesome how this level 7 Queen has survived there, guys. And uh, we've actually got over 70% damage on this base. That is unexpected. I did not think that was going to happen. We still got the Pekka. It goes down. And uh, we got 1 minute and 2 seconds on the clock. So let's see if we can grab maybe at least these two Elixir Collectors here, guys. That would be awesome. I think there's about maybe 50,000 Elixir in there. And every penny counts. So there goes the first one. Archer Tower is now going down just over 45 seconds, guys. Queen is going to change plans. She's changed her route. And she's going to go for our Wizard Tower. Now remember, I just changed my attack strategy, guys. So this is the last time I will be using this army. We are now going to incorporate some Valkyries and a little bit of Dark Elixir. So I'm hoping it's going to be a little bit more OP, guys. Here we go. 20-something seconds remaining. If the Queen can swing round and take on one of those gold collectors. No, okay, we may as well end it there, guys. She's not going to do it. But look at that. Not bad. 400,000 Elixir. And we got a star bonus. And that increased to 45 from 35, guys. So that is my plan. Can we get two Town Hall 11s before Town Hall 12 is released, guys? Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe to the channel and make sure you have a great weekend guys. I'll see you shortly. Peace out